glucose spikes and glucose crashes. I don't actually use those words, by the way. I don't like to actually cast our body's metabolism in terms of spikes and crashes. I think those are fear words that get attention. Uh, they, they do make you pay attention to it. But in fact, our the healthy body sort of has, you know, smooth ups and smooth downs. They're gentle slopes up and down of our blood sugar, and that's completely fine. All right. And, and it should be like that. However, if you have an uphill climb of your blood glucose and it continues to stay up, that can actually happen if you're eating too much added sugar. Okay. Added sugar, ultra processed foods. What happens is that your blood sugars, your intake of the sugar glucose rises up, 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 up. And now your body has your metabolism to chase that blood sugar down and it's got to work harder and make more insulin. And eventually you just wear out that system. And then you have high blood, blood glucose and an insensitive metabolism. And then that's the beginning of sort of the the dominoes starting to fall apart in your body. And so sugar, high blood sugar, added sugar is a problem. You get it from fruit, not a problem, okay? No one's gonna be eating a crazy amount of fruit. This is why extremes aren't good. Diversity, switch it out. Keep it interesting for yourself. This is what our human nature uh, wants anyway.